Hi guys, so I've realised I haven't done a fashion haul for quite a while now and I really miss doing them and the reason for this is because I really do think it's the time of year to be honest um, it's that in between stage, we don't know whether to carry on buying winter clothes because it's still absolutely freezing or the feeling of wanting it to be spring and summer and buying all the new clothes and finding out what the new trends are going to be and the new colours and etc. Anyway, so it's a bit of an in-between time where everywhere is just having a sale. So if you can find something good in the sale, then that's brilliant, but you can't always find something good in the sale. And especially shops like Primark, they've just literally got what I've had in for months now and they haven't really got anything new in my local one anyway so that's why I haven't done a Primark call for a while I have been in there a couple of times and I even did a follow me around vlog which went totally totally wrong if you follow me on Twitter and on my blog then you will have seen what I wrote about it and stuff um, but that didn't work out and I didn't really buy anything anyway but I have bought a few things over I'd say the past month six weeks a couple of things that I wanted to show you um, and yeah so they're all from various places but I'll let you know where they're from so I'll just get started straight away so I got a couple of things in the Zara sale first of all I got this skirt um, don't know if you can see it properly very floral and bright so I think it will look quite nice for in the summer and it cost me I've taken label up, but I think it was $7.99 in the sale. And I just think it will look quite nice if it's worn high waisted, maybe even with a top like this because it's like contrasting patterns. And it will just look pretty. Probably it will look nice. It would probably look nice with a vest top, plain like black or white vest top, or maybe red or blue to match the print. Um, I could even wear it now, you know, with um, opaque tights and things like that. So I just thought it was really pretty. And got little pockets on the sides at the front the sides at the front and it reminds me of the skirts the plain ones that you get from American Apparel which are about 18 pounds also in that sale I picked up this t-shirt I like black and white t-shirts with a photographic print on them so I got this one and I really like it again I can't remember how much it was but it wasn't too expensive it was probably it might have been four ninety nine, or it might have been like six ninety nine, but it was around that price. Definitely under ten pounds. Um, and yeah, it's quite big, but it can be again tucked into skirts and things like that. Maybe into this skirt, which I'm going to show you next, which is a basic bodycon skirt from um, H and M. And these cost like three ninety nine or four ninety nine. They're really really good. Um, yeah very plain basic but it's a really good staple to have in your wardrobe because you can wear these um, with opaque tights with a t-shirt tucked in or you could wear them with maybe a longer top that you feel like you'd wear on its own but it's a bit too like risque to wear on its own so you could wear a black bodycon skirt just underneath it just to you know make you feel a bit more um, covered up. I'm really loving these striped Breton t-shirts at the moment um, and H&M do these like relatively cheap obviously it's white t-shirt with blue stripes long sleeves and it's kind of baggy fitting but I quite like that because again you can tuck them into skirts all of these clothes can kind of be worn together you could wear this top tucked into this skirt or tucked into Levi shorts whatever you've got with your opaque leggings so I decided to get it in the um, white and I can't even speak today, white and I think it's like a greyish, bluey, blacky colour. We'll say grey, so it's exactly the same as this one. Um, but I think it's actually like cream and black or cream and grey, because that one looks a lot whiter. So yeah, pretty much the same top though, and they're really cheap as well. Again, I can't remember how much they are, but I don't want to say, but they are really cheap. I've been really loving scarves at the moment, so I've picked up a few scarves over the last few weeks. I've got this one from a stall in my shopping centre where near where I live and they sell like scarves like this so it's very much Alexander McQueen-esque but hopefully you know not copying it too much but um, yeah I just thought it was really pretty and you could wear it with lots of different things and it's very it's become quite a classic print so I quite like that then this one is from Primark and it's just a pretty floral um, silky you know chiffony scarf and it's really nice and I got this because I wanted a scarf that I could wear as um, like a 
a hair turban so like you know when you put it on how am I doing it when you put it on like that and you twist it round and you know when you wear them kind of round like that I can't do it at the moment and that just looks totally weird but I'll try and do like um, a tutorial on it or something it's really not difficult yeah I really like these thin chiffon scarves because you can do a lot of them and like tie them in your hair and stuff and I also picked up these two scarves from Primark they were £3 each these are a bit thicker than that chiffon one so you couldn't wear them in your hair really but this one's a kind of giraffe print fabric and this one's floral and yeah they're just really pretty scarves that you can just pair if you're maybe if you're wearing quite a plain outfit and you want to make it look a bit more funky nice different then you can wear something like that um, this I think I might have shown in a Primark haul the, la the last one that I did but I can't remember so I thought I'd show you again it's a polka dot kind of um, mauve play suit with cream dots on um, yeah play suit sleeveless got this little collar on it so you probably would have to wear a top underneath um, double breasted and a tie around the waist so you can cinch it in and then shorts really pretty I haven't even worn this yet and I got it quite a long time ago um, so I've got to wear this soon but it was £13 I think it's nice because um, you can wear it again with the opaque tights and things like that and you can wear a cardigan over the top because it's sleeveless until it's warm then you can wear it bare legs and bare arms and it'll look really cool for the summer as well um, as for cardigans I've got two cardigans recently both of them I actually ordered online um, I got this one from New Look online and it's a thick knit with a bit of a cable knit on the front and the thing I really like about it are the buttons they're like leather effect buttons um, and it's really pretty I, I haven't got a cream thick knit cardigan you know what I'm like for my cardigans so I got that one again I can't remember how much it was I think it was around £26 something like that I also ordered for the first time ever off forever21.com because obviously we've got the forever21 the first one to open in the UK at the ball ring in Birmingham but I live nowhere near Birmingham I do want to take a trip up there at some point but I, I don't live anywhere near Birmingham so I ordered online because we've obviously got the Forever 21 website in the UK now I only got one thing and it was this cardigan it's really hard to show on the camera and to show it you know looking nice I'll try and button the first button up so it'll fall together a bit so it's got this plaited detail right down the front um, and it's got these buttons on it so you can pop them all together and it's really really lovely it's really thick it's a really pretty biscuity beigey colour um, it's got like I said the um, plait going all the way around it and it's really heavy it's really good quality um, and I was just impressed with this I really like it um, it's got pockets on either side and yeah it looks really nice done up or open um, it's very slouchy and casual and again I can't remember how much it was but I'm pretty sure it's still on their website so go and check out Forever 21 in the UK and then finally my two favourite things that I've bought in the in the last couple of weeks I bought this dress which you've already seen in a video I wore it in my what I got for Christmas video it's absolutely gorgeous I love it so much it's this Peter Pan collared um, kind of orangey brownie colour polka dot dress and it doesn't come in at the waist or anything it's got this bit across here and it just like drops all the way down but because it's fairly short it doesn't look odd or anything I mean you could wear it for belt if you wanted to but it just is a really cute smock style dress um, and obviously sleeveless as well so um, be nice to wear in the summer um, but I wear it with like opaque tights and stuff at the moment again I think this is um, new, new in I think so check out their website or see in store, I want to say it was about £28 something like that, finally I got another Peter Pan, Peter Pan collared dress um, because I'm a bit obsessed with them at the moment for some reason this one's from New Look and I actually really like it because it's plain black but it's got this small bit of leopard print on it and I like a little bit of leopard print I think it looks really cute um, so the dress it's hard to show you because it's black 
but it has a tie around the waist so you can cinch it in so this is a bit different to the other one and it looks nice it fits nicely and it just looks nice um, it has three quarter length sleeves which are elasticated so you can roll them up um, and have them quite short or have them down and then again it's fairly short I mean it comes above the knee but not too far above the knee but it's just a really lovely dress I love these collars so much I'd just wear them on everything if I could um, and it was about £26 I literally cannot remember the price of anything that I've bought <laughs> so bad I should have like looked at the receipts before I made this video but um, it was because I haven't bought the, like, the last time I bought one of these things was probably about a week ago the last thing I bought if that makes sense was a week ago so that's why I can't remember any of the prices um, so yeah that's everything that I've bought recently that I could find to show you because I really wanted to do a haul video um, as soon as I get out there and you know there's new spring summer stuff coming in then I'm sure I'll have a Primark haul and other random hauls to show you but if there are any other videos you'd like to see in the meantime then just put them in the comments below and I'll try and get around to doing them for you. Um, so yeah, hope you like this video guys and I'll speak to you later. Bye!